Sir, I'm Jay Cavendish, son of Lady Cavendish. We're all sons of bitch. Keep heading west solo. You'll be dead by dawn. I take care of myself. Sure, kid. You need chaperoning. And that is a clip from the film Slow West, now playing in the Tribeca Film Festival after winning the World Cinema Grand Jury Prize at Sundance, and it will be released nationwide in May. Joining us now are two of the film's stars, Cody Smith-McPhee and Ben Mendelsohn. Welcome to both of you. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thank you very much. Jody, let me start with you because, sorry, Cody, let That's me okay. start with you because your character, Jay, is in some ways the heart of the film. You are determined to travel so far to find your lost love. Tell us about the lengths your character goes to. Of course. I think that's the beautiful part of seeing kind of two worlds collide, an almost um, French look on cinematography meets the Western civilization. Um, and seeing his love and, and, and this pure entity kind of go through such a violent, dirty world, but that pureness of the love is what's taking him through that. Um, it, it's really powerful and it's, it's, it's quite amusing to watch as well at some points. From Scotland to the rough and ready American frontier where there are rattlesnakes like pain, your character awaiting. Ben, can you tell us about pain? Yeah, absolutely. He's a bounty hunter who, uh, who ran with Michael Fassbender's character back in the day. Um, Michael, M Michael Fassbender's character arrives and looks like he might be saving Cody's character, but we're not really that sure whether he's after the bounty himself. There's a hefty bounty on his head and it's attracted a lot of attention. So that's what Payne's come for. He's, uh, he's hunting for that gold and the gold just happens to be uh, this fine gentleman here. It's so interesting, the romance of Europe and the rough and ready sort of lawless nature of the American West. This film seems to take the American Western and give it a twist. When you read the scripts, when you both were handed the script, did you see that originality in it or did it come out in the process of filming? I, I believe I felt it within the script, absolutely. Yeah. I always try to find whatever is attracting me to, to doing that. Uh, I want to find that love within the art, within the craft, and that was definitely there. And especially after I spoke to the director, I saw that his heart was in the, the same place that my heart was in when I read the story. So, yes, absolutely. Because the Western is such a beloved you know, oh. film genre, right? And this really makes it something new, which is sort of fascinating. Yeah, and it, look, it, it is that case of the Western, and, and, and lots of genres are always up for reinterpretation, and, uh, you know, film lovers come to it with their own thing and so John McClane the filmmaker and this is his first film has come to it with very fresh eyes a European perspective and uh, he shot it quite beautifully and it's um it has almost uh, a dark really, fairy tale quality yeah this, very much which is lovely. very much and uh, look he's achieved something quite beautiful mm -hmm. I think that most people imagine shooting a Western must be terrific fun so tell us did you have a lot of fun shooting this there was. It was a lot, <laughs> a of, lot fun of fun. And a lot of really great people to be around and, and have a good time with, absolutely. But there was quite the gorilla moments, I'm sure, too, um, mm. going right. through that Western world. Um, yeah, the horses can get pretty ordinary, oh, yeah. and then uh, that's uh, that's <laughs> basically horses. yeah. When you're dealing with the yeah, the horses can get ordinary. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Well, Cody and Ben, thanks to both of you for being here, and congratulations on making such a gorgeous film. Thank you. For thanks having for having us.